Hey there, Trooper! Today we're looking at editing clips in Resolume Arena and Avenue. The goal of this tutorial is to teach you how to trim and edit your clips for better use during your live shows. All techniques shown in this tutorial are aimed at show preparation. We'll cover the basics, but there are some more advanced shortcuts and tricks in here too. So let's get going. Here I have a clip playing in Resolume Arena. I can trim the length of the clip by using the handles in the clip panel. This is done by clicking and dragging the handles. Alternatively, you can click on the handle, click on the number box, and then use a numerical value to assign the handle to a spot on the timeline. You can right click on a handle to reset it to the begin or end point. While holding down the shift button, you can drag the entire selection around. This is used when you need a predefined clip duration, let's say 3 seconds. In that case, you don't want to tweak both handles while making your corrections. Let me show you another shortcut for editing in 1 second increments. If you hold down the shift key and hit the arrow icons above the handles, you will move them in 1 second increments. But what if we want to do the opposite and edit on a microscopic level? In that case, you can hold down the Option key on Mac or the Alt key on Windows while dragging the handle. This allows you to make edits in increments of one hundredth of a second, or centiseconds for all you watchmakers and cuckoo clock fans out there. We should also mention that all these editing methods can be applied when editing parameter animations too. I can use the previous method on the animation timeline I created for this blur effect. When we are done editing, we can save the clip by rendering it. To save the clip, with the trim and all parameter animation, right click the clip handle and select Render to File. Arena will render the file with the trimmed length and include all the effects and animations applied to your clip. Watch our video on clip rendering if you wish to learn more. If you wish to take your editing workflow to the next level, you should consider creating a custom layout for editing which we'll do right now. I will start with the default layout of Resolume Arena. First we need to get rid of all the panels we don't need for clip editing. This means that panels like Composition, Layer and Source can all go. We need only a single monitor, so the preview monitor gets closed too. Next I will set the monitor to Selected Clip. Now we are only previewing the clip and we've got access to the transform widget. This allows us to scale, move and rotate our footage from within the monitor. Also make sure to set the background of that monitor to transparent. I will add the render panel and combine it with the file panel. To declutter the clip panel, we'll get rid of the autopilot, cue points and dashboard. This can all be done through the view menu. Now we have a very wide timeline for our clip, which is ideal for editing. We can speed up our workflow even more by adding some keyboard shortcuts. I will use the shortcut menu to enter the keyboard shortcut mode. Next I will create a new shortcut preset and let's call it clip editing. Now it's time to add the shortcuts. I will bind the rewind, pause and play buttons to the J, K and L buttons on my keyboard. Next I bind the in and out markers to the I and O keys. Note that here you can have the markers jump to the playhead or mouse. I prefer playhead but this is up to you. And to round up my shortcuts I will bind the A button to the alpha channel. This allows me to toggle the alpha channel on and off. Now it's time to save my editing layout. I'll head to the view menu, navigate to layout and hit save. It will take a bit of time to set up an editing workflow that you like. But having a layout like this on hand can save you a lot of time when you're in a pinch. You might want to add additional panels like the record panel to your interface, but that's all personal preference. I hope you've learned something today and you can keep on trimming.